Hi guys, so this is Grace again and welcome back again to my channel. So it's uh, Tuesday here, it's uh, 1 p.m. in the afternoon. So I am on the way to the mountains and we're gonna get some Sinaguilas fruit. We call her Sinaguilas here in the province, in the, in the Philippines. So my friend uh, Daibashun go with me. So it's nice weather today. It's not really hot. It's cloudy. It's been spring cold a little bit. So I hope you guys are doing good. So it's another beautiful day here in the Philippines. Yay! Yeah, hey. It's another beautiful day to be grateful. So I hope you guys are doing good and um Thank you so much uh, guys for always supporting my YouTube channel and my friend there at the back she gonna go with me and we're gonna get some mango also guys so that mango that we, we gonna get is not uh, ripe yet it's the mango of my grandma so let's see guys if we can get some sinaguilas fruit and some mango fruit and we're gonna walk going to the mountains so punta po kami guys kukuha po kami ng sinaguilas at saka yung manga masarap yung manga guys kapag uh, ilag, uh, kapag may hipon so masarap talaga yun kapag may hipon kapag matamis na po yung manga is uh, masarap po yun uh, uh, mango flute gagawa kayo ng mango flute masarap yun so we are here we're still going we're still on the way there to the mountains and we're gonna have some uh, hike this afternoon so since the weather is good so we, ca we, uh, we, are in, we are able to walk it's not uh, it's not hot it's cloudy today it's been sprinkled a little bit so so we're on the way there so look at that carabao guys we are very relaxed we are relaxed in the water so one of our neighbor owns this one lots of carabaos on this side and that side over there so lots over there so maraming pung kalabaw dito guys lots of carabao so we are on the way now Getting that uh, mango fruit and sinaguilas fruit. Oh, it sprinkles here. I hope we are able to go there because it's raining here. Sprinkles a little bit. So this is the farm of my grandma here. Uh, her vegetables farm and also some banana field here Asot age Diri age ikaw na dai So look at that papaya over there It's not ripe yet still green Oh it's raining it's raining now have a lot of pineapple here look at that wow oh my look at that pineapple looks delicious pineapple so guys you have a lot of pineapple here look at that <laughs> A lot of pineapple and an oversight over there. They have a lot of pineapple over there. So my grandma owns this uh, pineapple here. She have a lot of pineapple uh, plant here. And when it gets ripe, uh, my grandma will gonna give some to us. My husband loves pineapple. He loves to eat pineapple, guys, because this kind of pineapple here is very sweet. So we're gonna walk going there in the top. As you can see, that have a lots of mango here. We have we have a lots of mango tree here. My grandma owns this uh, one. 
as you can see, they have a lot uh, there in the tree. They have a lot of mango fruit. Look at that mango, uh, mango fruit, guys. It's a lot. This is mango tree. So look at that. It, they have a lot of mango here. And my grandma owns this one also over here. Look at the fruit. So it's good to eat with uh, shrimp paste, shrimp uh, paste, and spicy shrimp paste. Or uyap, we call this a hipun here in the Philippines. So it's good for for hipun that mango. When it get ripes, uh, we gonna make some mango shake on it and also a mango flute. It's good for mango flute. So we are here, almost there on the top. We're still walking. So lots of mango here, and they have also a cashew, cashew fruit there. I'm gonna show you later guys the cashew and some guava also here wow have a lots of fruits here in the mountains guys so this dog is always following with us that's our navigator <laughs> so we are here look at the view is nice And look at that view guys. That's a cashew tree over there. And look at that beautiful view there. So we're gonna check the cashew tree if they have some fruit on it. And that's a cashew tree over there. So my friend Bashun gonna check if I, if it bears some fruit. Pahak siya. She found uh, one cashew. But the problem is the bird eat half of it. <laughs> so it means the bird is uh, get hungry and uh, she just uh, eat that cashew fruit over there because it's ripe already So I'm gonna show you guys the cashew the cashew fruit So my friend we're gonna bring it here And look at that beautiful view down there the mountains that bamboo tree there from the distance <laughs> look at this cashew fruit here the birds eat some of this look at that it's good and this is cashew over there in the top this is good guys my husband loves this one too uh, he's eating this before and he loves the this uh, cashew fruit and also this seed the cashew seed is really good yeah you, that this seed the cashew seed you can grill it and it's really really good so i'm gonna show you now the the place where we at so that's banana over there as you can see have a banana there and look at over here they have a lots of lemongrass my uncle owns this one the brother of my grandma so he have a lots of pineapple here too look at that guys a lots of pineapple wow lots of them here so my uncle is the one who owns this pineapple field here look at that guys Oh, so lots of them. Look at that. Look at there in the bottom. Tabi tabi. Oh my god, it's a lots of them there. It looks delicious. So 
So we are here. So my friend gonna get some sinaguilas fruit. And she's already there on the tap. And I'm gonna show you the sinaguilas fruit. She's over there on the tap. I was going to climb. But not a lot of them are ripe this time. It's not ready yet. So look at that. Sinaguilas fruit. It's still green. It's still not uh, ready to eat. It's not ripe yet. So we have a lot here. So my uncle owns this Sinaguilas fruit here. Mm, many of them. So it's not ready yet to eat. So my friends are over there on the top. And she gonna get the ripe Sinaguilas fruit. And as you can see, this tree is not is not as high as the coconut. So, marami pong sinaguilas dito, guys. So, hindi pa po yan ready. Yung iba, yung nasa taas ay ready na pong kainin. So, yung nasa ibaba is hindi pa po ready kain kasi hindi, po, pa, hindi pa po nahinug. So, yung oh, friend ko, relax na relax doon sa taas. <laughs> So this is the sinaguilas fruit. It's already ripe. So look at the color. It's uh, maroon in color. It's look. It's really looks delicious, guys. And you just uh, put some salt on it, some small salt, and you just eat it. And also, my husband loves this sinaguilas fruit. It's really good. But this time they have, uh, they don't have a lot that it's ready to eat because some of them are not ripe enough to eat. So over on this side, they have a lots of them, a lots of sinaguilas tree on this side here. So you can see um, over there, it's sinaguilas tree over there also. And we're gonna check their upstairs, there in the top. We're gonna check more sinaguilas. So we're almost here on the top and my friend found this lumboy tree. So she gonna get some java plum leaf to make uh to put some tobacco on this one and she gonna sell it to the market. It's a lot of them here. We call this lumboy, dahon ng lumboy. So she gonna put tobacco inside on the java plum leaf and she gonna sell it to the market. And look at that beautiful view again, guys. It's really really Amazing. So we found this one, this sinaguilas tree over here. And look at that guys. Have a lot of ripe. Have a lot of ripe on this side and this tree here. Oh my god. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. So look at that guys. So over there on the top, have a lots of them, lots of ripe, wow, this is really good, it's hard to climb here because it's slippery, because the ground as you can see is very dry and it's very slippery to step, and look at that there on the top, they have a lots of ripe, have a lots of ripe, that one. we're gonna get many so my friend gonna get some sinaguilas fruit I was going to climb there but she told me that she's the one only will gonna climb because I'm wearing shoes she's not wearing some shoes there's a lot of them over here there there's a lot guys Oh, I'm so excited to eat. That's one of my favorite fruit. So just let me know guys if uh, you eat that fruit. And what you think. What's, what's the taste of it. If you like it or not. If one of you eat that fruit uh, already. Just let me know. Just message me on, on this video. And if you like it or not.
But my husband tried that before and he, re he really likes it. So it's a lot of them here. But it's not ready yet. So that side over there, that's a Java plum tree. It's almost uh, also bearing some fruits and when it bears, bears some fruits, I'm gonna show you the fruits of Java plum fruit. So it's good also guys. And the color of that is color uh, violet. And it's really sweet. <coughs> Let's walk to the side here. And as you can see that uh, have flowers on that java plum tree so it's almost bear some fruit then I'm gonna show you when it bears some fruit I'm gonna show you uh, the fruit of, of the java plum tree it's nice hi guys so this uh, herbal medicine here we call this gaboon this is the one I used uh, for the leg of my husband, the one um, he got a uh, leg pain. So this uh, herbal medicine, this is what I've used. I just uh, put some hot water on it and also some ethyl alcohol and I just uh, rub it uh, to his legs. Then after three days, uh, his uh, leg pain is get better. So this uh, herbal medicine leaf is very effective if you have some body pain and this is really really effective. So we're still here the, here in the mountains right now and we have this uh, sinaguilas fruit on my hand. It's very ripe and we're gonna get some mango also in a few minutes. We'll just go uh, walk down there to the mango tree there in the bottom and so it's really nice here because it's not so hot this time it's have a nice breeze here look at the chinaguilas fruit it's a lot of them mm, many and we're gonna eat this later and now we're gonna get some mango after this one so we are on the way going down now so my friend Bashon gets some foods for the goat they have a lots of goat and she carries some foods for the goat they have some I don't know how many goats that they own so she just gets some weed, some grass here from the mountains and she gonna feed the goats later. So we're going down and we're gonna pick up, pick some mango. We're gonna get some mango there in the bottom. And we have this java plum leaf here. And look at that dog, the two dogs. They keep following with us. And she gonna get more uh, foods for the goats there. It's life here in the Philippines. Province life. And we're gonna get some mango over there in the bottom. Hmm. She's she gonna get some more leaf for the goats, foods for the goats. They own a lot of goats and it's been long time now that they raise some goats. That's uh, the way they do for living. They, they raise some goats and they're gonna sell it when, it when it gets bigger. So most of the... Uh, people here in the province especially here in our place they have a lot of animals that they raised and they're gonna sell it when it gets bigger or some of them especially when you are raising some pigs they're gonna sell it to the market or sell it to the community here around us per kilo 
So, di gonna sell it per kilo and di gonna make some big profit on it. So, my mama also owns uh, three piglets right now and and she gonna sell it uh, maybe around June. So, she gonna sell it. So, um, I'm gonna show you also the time that how they gonna kill the pigs and it it be more fun here in the philippines the way they kill the pigs and i'm gonna show you when the time comes and right now i'm still waiting for my friend she's getting some uh foods for the goat it's nice here <laughs> and look at that mango there guys we're getting some mango right now. Look at that, it's a lot. I'm so excited of uh, this a mango will get, uh, will ripe because I'm gonna make some mango flute. And look at this one here. Uh, looks good. Uh, look at that bigger one in the top. It will get bigger. Hmm. Maybe. Kaya niya sa daimaki aniday. Kaya mga hapon ba? Ato niyo skilahan. Look at that. Hmm. Nguap ng itong mangga. Puting pagkakagmaya. Ganiya. It's mainly there on the top. I can't. Uh, I cannot eat too much mango because it's not good for my acid. I mean, it's not good for me because I have some acid reflux. So I can't eat too much sour foods. I just need to be careful for myself because it's really hard if you get sick. So we're gonna get more mango there, down there in the bottom. Oh, we have a lots of fruits that we pick this, this afternoon. <laughs> We're so lucky. And so, have a lot of pineapple there in the bottom too. So you can see that there, over there. Many pineapple. So lots of mango here. More mango here. Oh, big, big one. And we are on the way home now. So thank you so much guys for watching and please don't forget to subscribe, like, and share. Thank you guys. God bless us all. Thank you so much for watching.